Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be trying to recreate a Valentine's makeup look for you guys from Beauty by Bianca. Um, I'm also gonna be trying out the Beauty by Bianca and Doe Color uh, makeup brush sets. I'm gonna be reviewing it for you throughout this video. I'm gonna try to use as many as I can and if you want to see how I think the brushes are and if they're worth your money and how I ended up doing this look, please keep on watching. And it has 14 pieces of makeup brushes. In the back it tells you a little bit of what it is and their information. They are so cute, so pretty. They are so pretty. I am so excited to try them on because she is one of my favorite YouTubers. She goes live on Facebook like all the time. I love watching her all the time. It says Beauty by Bianca by Doe Color. It's a collab that she made with them. They are, all the big brushes have this little like mesh protector just so um, it could protect the shape of it. So today I'm going to be making a Valentine look with these brushes. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use all of them, but I'm going to try to use most of them and then at the end I'll tell you if it's worth it. Right now, I believe her brushes are out of stock. Um, but she did say that she was going to bring them back. So, yeah. Because I'm so excited because this is the first video that I'm recording on my new camera. I used to be using my phone, but yo. So I'm going to be prepping my skin. I already put on like a moisturizing cream and I'm going to go with the Unicorn Essence for Solid. Serum is just an oil. It's just an oil to help with my skin. I do have really extremely dry skin. I'm also going to be going, I'm going to let this dry and I'm going to be going with the Too Faced Hangover Primer. I'm going to let it dry so that we can get started. So I think for today I'm going to try to recreate one of her looks. I'm not sure if it's going to be exactly the same yet but it's gonna be kind of similar oh my god you guys i am so dumb i was already gonna wet my beauty blenders but she does have a foundation brush so i'm gonna be using that instead i don't really like doing my foundation with brushes i don't know why i never did like it but we're gonna try i am gonna be going in with the makeup forever h ultra hd foundation stick i am the in the color y325 i think i'm also y335 it's just a foundation stick it's i feel like it's easier because you don't get too messy i do make a lot of mess with my foundation it seems to be I'll probably regret doing my foundation first because I usually always do my eyes first. But I don't know what I'm doing. Like, it is blending. Oh my god, it's so cute. I really like the fact that it's flat because if you put like liquid foundation, you could actually put it in on top of here. And then just go in and first like pat it in, you know, like spread it out evenly. And then you could go ahead and buff it out or however. Um, you could also put it in your, the phone or in a little container, wherever you put it in a little palette or whatever. And you could also pick it up from here and put it in, tap it in and blend or 
your foundation into your face I didn't really struggle and I know it's usually like pretty hard because it's not liquid so it's harder to blend it out but I really liked it you guys it wasn't that hard I'll probably start using it a little bit more especially with liquid foundations that I do make a mess even with the beauty blend so it's really really nice they're soft they're not like hard for you don't hurt you or anything so yeah so far so good okay guys so it says here that it has a concealer brush on number 13 but I saw her video where she explains that um, about like everything that the brushes are because they don't come with actual numbers on it so I believe this is what they mean about the concealer brush and it's mainly to clean up the brows that's what she explained so I think I'm actually gonna do my concealer with the beauty blender just because there's not really one that um, I would like to use for that since I'm trying to use everything just as she explained in her video. You probably noticed that I'm not in my room anymore. That's because we have to go get my daughter and okay. and my baby is in my room with my husband. Okay, so I'm already done putting on the concealer. We're gonna go next with the contour. I use cream contour, but I think because of this brush, it looks more like if it's a for powder contour. So. I'm going to use the Ultra Beauty. I usually do the cream contour first and then I go in with the powder one. But I don't want to fudge up the, the brush. So I am going to be using the Beauty Blender to set the under eyes. Think. I'm going I'm gonna take a little bit. Oh yeah, I'm using the uh, the vanilla powder by Besame Cosmetics. And I am gonna be going with the powder brush, which is I guess considered the number one brush. I'm gonna put a little bit of product, not that much. and set my face i think now we're gonna be doing our brows this is this is the brush number 14 which is the which is a brow brush this is what it looks like and it also comes with a spoolie i'm gonna be going with the l'oreal paris liner in the color espresso 173 like so i'm gonna be doing my brows with the brow um brush okay guys so i went ahead and did my brows off camera so far i'm really liking her brushes because they aren't that harsh the brow brush the brow brush was is pretty flat and i like it because i can go uh really into the line and not like you could do little hairs in the front if you don't have a lot of hairs you could create that effect and it's really nice you guys the spoolie is pretty soft it's not hard at all so yeah Next, we're going to be going with the concealer brush, which is the brush number 13. And it looks like this. This, she explained that it was mainly um, to clean up the brows and also like to, to clean up the wig liner or, you know, like with the concealer and stuff like that. You know, she's 
Okay. Okay, so I should have done this before I set my eyes and everything, but that's I am going to go back with the beauty blender just to blend out the concealer. And since the beauty blender does have a little bit of the setting powder, it will help me set it all. Okay, so... This is how my brows ended, and so I am debating between two looks of her. There is this one, uh, and this one, which they're almost similar. Um. I want something simple just because I really don't have a lot of this. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is what it says in the package. So there are six blending brushes. In her video, she said that this she uses it for highlighting. So I mean, I counted. But supposedly, maybe this one is the fluffy blending brush. Um, there's two normal blending brushes, which um, I'm guessing. I don't know which ones they are. But yeah, so two blending brushes, two one-pointed blending brush, and two small blending brushes. So that's the fluffy one, which we already said it was her highlight. So these are four blending brushes. It's really nice because there's not a lot of blending brushes on the usually on the makeup brush sets um, so yeah I really really like the fact that she uh, emphasized more on the blending brushes but I really like the fact that they're really good quality and they're not that expensive so I'm going in with the desert sand um, on the Huda Beauty um, Desert Dusk Palette colors, I'm going in with this one. Yep, let me put it all over. We're gonna be going with the full spectrum. You know what? I'm gonna be going in with Alchemy, which is. Uh, in between, kind of like purplish pinkish shade it's a little bit more purple than pink and I will be going in with one of the small brushes tapping off the excess let's blend I really like this blending brush the small ones because it helps you stay a little bit more in place and you get a little bit more of control over the whole situation okay guys so i'm gonna be going in with the same urban decay full spectrum palette and i'm going to be using shade gossip which is this color and put it in my inner corner with the pencil brush which is brush number 11 this is what it looks like okay so we are gonna now we're gonna be trying out the blush brush and the only blush that i have available is fantasy from the ultra beauty little palette that i have so i'm gonna, so I'm gonna be going in with the blush brush Excess and pull up. Okay. 
Last but not least, I'm going to be using the highlighter brush and I'm going to use the yellow diamond highlighter from the Ulta Beauty palette that I have here, which is this one. Guys, you see the application? It's bomb.com. Oh, actually, I'm done with the brushes. I'm going to be putting in the skin. Dimitri James Bright Eyes Eye Enhancing Eyeliner. Which looks like this. And it's just like a peachy color. I'm, I'm going to put it on my water. I'm gonna go in with the spoolie just to fix my eyelashes. Yeah. I'm gonna be going in with ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip on the shade Cheap. Cheap Thrills. Like that. Now I'm going to be going with the Urban Decay Child Setting Spray, Setting and Hydrating Spray. And I am done with the look. Don't mind my crazy hair that I haven't brushed in like two days. But this is what it looks like. I love the brushes. They are amazing. They are super soft. They are beautiful. A 14 brush set. This is what they look like. They are they retail for $39.99. The whole set is $39.99. It's a collab with beauty by bianca and doll color so i think right now they are out of stock but she did say that she was gonna be putting them back again their information is right here i will put the link down below so it's synthetic uh hair it is 14 pieces for 39.99 um i really like them i think they are pretty affordable for how gorgeous they look and the amount that you get and also the quality they're really nice quality they're pretty soft and i really like them and i really recommend it i don't know when they're going to be back in stock but um i hope you guys like this video please like comment and subscribe to my channel um comment anything that you would like to see next if you keep on like if you like this video Please let me know. Let me know any other videos that you would like for me to do. And yeah. Bye.